For almost three decades, the Ateneo de Zamboanga School of Medicine stands at the forefront of medical education. Community medicine lies at the core of ADZUSOM's mission, recognizing that the health and well-being of a community are vital to its progress and development. With this understanding, we have embraced a holistic approach to medical education, one that extends beyond the confines of the classroom and into the heart of the communities. Manos de Patrini, which is the Latin for Hands of God and Country, is composed of 47 medical students who aspire to be God's ambassadors by advocating for health here in the Philippines. The Ateneo de Zamboanga University School of Medicine's goal is to serve all Filipinos, especially those in marginalized areas. Sa awa ng Diyos naman, madami naman tayong na-accomplish, di ba? First na pagpunta natin sa community, akala ko talaga tayo yung magbabago ng community. Yung pala, yung community ang magbabago sa atin. One of the German physician, Rudolf Firko, once said, the physicians are the natural attorneys of the poor. We as medical students who work in the communities and work in the grassroots, I think we brought change in the community people. It may sound very cliche, but we believe that the best outcome from this experience was really the empowerment of the community people to come together and take charge of their health. It was eye-opening for everyone involved, especially us, who's heavily exposed to the notion that the lives of a medical doctor is enclosed within the walls of clinics and hospital. We have seen how the community developed and took initiative after we've conducted our health education. At first, we found it hard to communicate due to the language barrier. Um, to address distrust, we have to have a healthy two-way communication and with language getting in our way, it seemed to be a really impossible thing to do. However, we together strive hard to learn Visaya and it made everything easier. Our journey was really worthwhile. There was a time it seemed impossible because it was very difficult to change the beliefs of the people, especially that related to culture. I agree, but with continued perseverance and showing that we care, we are able to have an engaged community. Alhamdulillah for that, Throughout this experience, we have witnessed the power of compassion, dedication, and teamwork in aiming healthcare needs for the people. Juan Gurifan is the only group among all who live in mountains of Mahayag. We need to walk so far in a rocky uphill road just to reach the farthest poor of and make them be part of our activity. Before we arrive, people have little to no knowledge regarding health, but with our efforts, people have been made more aware regarding health, especially about hypertension, water sanitation, and the toilet. Our primary goal talaga naman is to, diba, is to empower them, the community, to foster self-reliance, and as well as to inspire them to um, take greater responsibility for their own environment and as well as their health. Diba? Uh, ini enforce namin yung health education namin as often as we could so that uh, we can remind them of its real life effects. Nalipay yud ko o curious kay ko nga niabot sila kay tungod kay taga City sila wala me kabalo sa ilang mga kinaiya kung unsa sila dayon mayo gud kay sila ngan niya sila sa amin. Dako kayo o gikatabang ang student medical doctor din sa uh, amua ang bahin sa tubig problema namo sila mo ay nakatabang sa amua kay ila mang gisubay kin sa kadtong mga walay CR og sila mo nagpa-provide sa amua og mga bowl gikan sa among kasing-kasing among kanunay ginahangdong ang kalambuan o kabaskog sa tanan wanguripan para sa tanan Bilip ko sa inyong trabaho. Sa ito pa, ang accomplishment ninyo, bila sa akong barangay, work po dyan ang akong gihatag ninyo. Na-enjoy yun ang tagalurman nila sa ilang kanang performance dire. Kadugaya, na-close na namo sila mga butan o mga guapa pa dyan. Sabay puro kanan, yung pangtagaan po ng mga BP. Kami po nga, dili kabalo mong BP. Gatuluan po nila kung saan pag BP. O nakarong kabalo na may dako kay impact sila sa amuang kay o kabalo sa una di pero kabalo magbibig karong kabalo na may 
So pwede na may kami na imobipi sa amuang by porok. For the last time, para sa mas hayag na kaugwaon, Norma Hayag! In our stay in Barangay San Isidro, we came up with activities, programs, and strategies that can be summed up into our project dasing. Pag-abot nila sa mga student doktor, dako nyo kayong kausapan ng barangay na mo, tawad kay itudlokan o mga yung mga katawan, kita na ko ang mga tao sa nasukan na abot ang mga doktors, ang mga student doktors, mura o dako na kayo o katabang kasama sa mga unity. Pag-unity sa mga tagpurok, sa mga tao. So, wish po na mo nga, kung once nga madoktor na mo, naapod mo sa among purok, I hope nga, ang inyong kasing-kasing magpabilin sa among purok. Again, thank you and God bless din yung tanan. Together, we have made a difference in the lives of families and individuals in bringing a positive change. That's it, isang isidro. Sa akong paglantaw sa mga student doctors, pag-abot yun nila sa among barangay, mga buutan o mapahiyumon, friendly o approachable sila, wala yun may kasaway kanila. Dili matukib ang among kalipay panahon na magtapok na sa barangay hall para sa dugang kadasig, dugang panagsuod sa usag-usa. Ako na po pasalamat gikan sa barangay official dari sa Lord Salong Dako na kami nga mga student doctor Dako kayo o katabang, aktibo kayong mga tao kung panahon nga sila maoy mo patawan mo mga meeting. Daghan nga training uh, sa mga volunteers. We may be different lahi-lahi mantang kiagian sa kinabuhi. Pero one thing that we are sure of is that we will never, never forget all our memories because those are etched in our hearts and in our minds. Everything we have achieved so far wouldn't be possible without the partnerships fostered throughout this journey. And to all the community people for the warm welcome, experiences, and life lessons we will forever cherish. Daghang salamat kaayo. Para sa mas himsog, hello Rizalo. Our great pride? Well, it's got to be our community health plans, right? Yep, and for our project Labo on Main Deal, we were able to make segregation easier with our waste holding facilities and regular garbage collection to our understanding with Menro. That's true, for Project Action Laban Alta Person, people can now regularly monitor their BP through the established BP for stations, and people have better access to their maintenance medications through an understanding with the RHU on bringing the meds directly to our barangay. And let's not forget our 167 square meters project with time. Ang inyong gipang research o gipang tudlo about sa health, naghatag po sila isip ilahang project diri sa mga barangay katong butanganan o basura. Ang project utan, usa ang hingdawat sa mga project nila ang presidente sa senior citizen. Muna yung paningkamutan po na muna nga ma-maintain ang iyahang pag kuan sa mao project tako kayo ang kalambuan sa among barangay tungod kay sa inyong inyo kaming gitudloan unsaon sa pag operal sa matag usag usa kami taga Purok City dili gayod makalimot ninyo labi na gayod sa akong pamilya tungod kay laking suod kamo kanamo bisan pa tuod sa among kapubrihon kung manginawat lang kami nga kun mahimo kamo successful nga doktor ng Diligyan mo makalimot na mo. I just want to say that um, it's not just their lives that changed ever since we stepped foot in Mahayag. So did ours. We've changed for the better. We've unlocked some new life skills. We've learned life lessons, which we will surely take with us wherever we go. So let's cherish our slogan till the end, guys. What is it again? Ati Manon ang komunidad kuyog sa pag-uswag. Sinag Santa Cruz! Initially, we had the impression that language would be our biggest barrier. But as the time progressed, we realized that our biggest barrier would be resources or the lack thereof. Thankfully, we have overcome this, right? And we managed to overcome this through the help of our Barangay Council, um, which helped us. You know? The Barangay Council, especially our Barangay Captain, Cap Erlinda Tapere, who helped in every way 
from procurement of uh, materials needed for our projects, um, info dissemination, and being the first ones to actually support our projects, which um, help a lot in making people see the importance of these projects. We also have the rural health units, especially the Pochimapas, Mangjoy Caban, and additionally, um, the Mahayan Municipal Hospital, especially Dr. Skoy and Bruce Ramos. Actually, we also have the Philippine Air Force from Zamboanga City, um, who despite the distance, they were very accommodating in um, responding to our request. And we also have non-government organizations. Uh, para sa mua, ang natabang sa mga proyekto sa mga street doctors na din naabot din sa mga uh, barangay, dako kayo kay nang Ako ang maganda ko kay katabang sa mga barangay kay sama na yung paghatag nila og mga tambal sa mga bata, sample rin sa Pro 4, baka na og imikan sa kalayo ba? Da yung sadyang naabot ang mga student doctors kung sa mga problema nila, dali na kayo nang natagahan da yun. Na-monitor po doon sa mga ilang mga sakit. Unang-una, blisarami para awarta, bagaw sa akpilite. Ikaduha, wala mi kanang meron gan de ko ano bunong ba sa hay dai managan ni nila ng mga medical doctors magabang ilan rin nagsobanan dai ikatulo hindi amin na bulan meritok center tungod kailan na magfacilitate pangarito da nila ano ka kulangon rin ni magfacilitate tilan pinagi rek si arte nanduan nami medlimpyo lawn lawnan ang aking mensahe sa mga medical doctors sir ma'am Alam ko magagaling kayong doctors, balang araw makamit niyo ang inyong pangarap at sana wag niyong kalimutan ang mga subani na katira dito. Sana babalik kayo kasi mamis ka namin. Alam namin na lahat ng ginawa niyo ay nakatulong sa mga subani dito. Kasi maganda kayo makitungo sa amin sa pagbigay ninyo ng gamot, lahat-lahat. Uh, buong puso ninyo ibinigay sa amin ang serbisyo ninyo buo. Babay, read lang na niyo. Mamiis ang gamo. So from the bottom of our hearts, thank you, Kaayo, Dagham, Salamat, and we love you, Parang Revon. Magkahiusa, magmadasigon, aron ang bunyaw, magmalambuon. Maayong bunyaw! Naalala niyo si Mang Peregrine na halaka? Isa sa mga hypertensive residents, sabi niya pa na, na lucky talaga siya and grateful talaga siya sa atin na nadala natin yung inaccessible medicines and services from the RHU sa kanya, especially na dito sa D1, geographically isolated tayo. And that is a great achievement, no? Na, na ang, yun na kumbaga, anong nakatulong tayo, that is a great achievement. Pero may mga, ano naman, mga pinagdaanan tayo. Uh, at first, Nahirapan tayo last 2020, walang tubig, walang signal dito. And then, yung road is very nefarious. And most importantly, the pandemic came. But even all of that, no, despite of all things, may mga tumulong naman sa atin, Pupa Karis. Tama, yan. Uh, even if we came from different backgrounds and different upbringings, ganyan, we were able to bridge uh, health gaps, naging anak nila tayo sa community, as well as religious gaps, ganyan, they were able to um, adapt to us as well, di ba po yan? Tama, so, yung tama yung pagsabi mo, no, na inadapt talaga tayo ng community. So, these programs, aside from the community people, hindi natin siya magagawa kung wala yung support ng ating mga sponsors. So, maraming tumulong sa atin galing sa mga government agencies, non-governmental organizations, mga private institutions, and individuals. So for them, we are really thankful for their help in our community exposure, di ba, Andrin? Yeah, the community people, the entire municipality has truly inspired our hearts. And because of that, we are able to move the community. Dako, kayo may pasalamat nila nga ang mga Dr. Cho din nga ni Adire. Kay Dako, kay sila na mo o ikatabang. Ilang giumol ang mga tao din hi sa barangay, ang labinagyod ang mga senior citizen. Ilag yun ang gihatagan o panahong yun. Huwag yun may gikasaway nila. Mura lang na silang among mga anak. Ta, uh, ang ilahang mga plano sa kinabuwi, magmalampuso, magmalampuso ng tanan. Um, kami po ay lubos na nagpapasalamat in behalf of the group to all the people, the organizations that help 
make our project successful. Again, we are Team IMD1, inspiring hearts, moving communities. It has been a pleasure and honor working with the municipality of Mayag and our respective barangays.